Hi, my name is Martha. I haven't blogged for a while, but I wanted to do a fashion blog for a change. My aim is to show the clothes that I wear because I'm sitting in a wheelchair. I pick particular clothes that suit my style, that are comfortable and look good when you're sitting down in a wheelchair. My clothes are probably considered fast fashion because I buy from Big W, Kmart, H&M, a bit from Maya and other little fast fashion shops. The reason why I do this is because I really make my clothes work hard for me and my wheelchair kind of ruins my clothes. I ruin the elbows and also the back of my chair because I have some Velcro there that sticks to my clothes and I haven't figured out how to fix it. In terms of shoes, I'm not a shoe person. So I have about two pairs that I'm comfortable with in winter. Today I'm wearing green jeans, a white tank, and then a, a beige cardi or a tank cardi. This is probably going to be my winter uniform because it, it just makes me happy to wear these. I also have white joggers on. So throughout this video, I will show you certain items of clothing and why I wear them. And then I'll also show some photos of me wearing the clothes sitting down in my wheelchair. Now I have some clothing that I'd like to show you that I will then show you in photos later on. But I just want to talk through all of my clothes that I have here and why I chose them. So firstly, I have a pair of white jeans and as you can see, they're just elasticized in the waist and that is because I can't do button fly. So all of my pants, bar one pair, are elasticized but they actually look like jeans. So I have a white pair and these are from Big W. I have my most loved check pair that my sister says I look like a chef in when I wear, wear them. And I love wearing this with um, black top and uh, my leather jacket or my denim jacket. Um, I also want to wear it with this, these two tops. So I'll be wearing that. And this is a fast fashion label, um, Valley Girl. And they weren't made very well. So I got my husband Andrew to do a bit of extra sewing just to make them a bit more durable. My next pair is probably more on the expensive side and there would be a more formal pair to go out. So they're beige and they're regatta, so from Maya. And they're just beautiful pants, as you can see. Um, I'm not very good at holding things up. So yeah, they're just from Maya. And then... I have a pair of jeans that I think we call them jeggings, but I don't call them jeggings because they're not tight. They're just, yeah, elasticized jeans again, and they do from H&M. So, yeah, they do my pants, and I love wearing them. They're all a soft material that is comfortable and just 
yeah, it doesn't hurt you. So if I were to wear a button fly, I'd be uncomfortable because the button digs into my tummy. And also I like to wear my pants under my belly button because if I cover my belly button, I feel like I can't breathe. So my belly button is like my nose. So if I cover my nose, I can't breathe. <laughs> so then I'm going to get into tops. And I've got three tops. So these are probably my favourites to get dressed up in. This is a knitted grey jumper. And it's a really good material in that it doesn't bubble very much and has stood the test of time on my wool chair. So, and this is from H&M. It's the basics. The next top I'll show you is a knitted top and this is also from H&M. And I'll show you the damage Oops, my water actually does. So as you can see there, there's peeling on the sides and that's from rubbing on my water. And then the third top I wanted to show you is a red tin stripe top and I absolutely love wearing this. I have a few different ones that I like to wear. And this has been severely damaged by my wheelchair, which is sad, but you can't really see the back. So it's only me that knows that it's been damaged. And then this at the moment is my favourite jacket. Um, I bought this at the beginning of last winter, but didn't get to wear it because we were home a lot. So I plan to wear it a lot this year, this winter. And it goes with everything. And so, Things that I want to point out about my tops are that they are quite short. I have a short torso because of my disability. I have scoliosis and so my torso is a lot shorter. And so I can get away with wearing smaller, shorter tops. Yeah, I just wanted to show you what I wear and why I wear them. I don't particularly go for long jackets especially, as sitting down on a long jacket is really uncomfortable. I tried to buy a trench coat once and it was like layers and layers of material that I really didn't know what to do with and I had to give it away. So the um, all my jackets are waist high. I hope that this has helped you get an idea of what I think a person in a wheelchair needs to wear to feel comfortable and also to look good. I will put up some photos showing you pieces that I've worn and how I put them together. If you have questions or comments, I'd love to hear. Um, if you have any clothing brands that you would recommend, that would be good if you could share that. Uh, if you guys think that I should perhaps make something different 
please let me know and I guess this video is inspired by all those fashion vlogs that are able to parade around standing up and walking around and showing you what their waist is like or how they've tucked something in or how a trench coat drapes to their calves and it's beautiful but it's something that a person with a disability can't parade around in I guess um yeah or even probably not parade around in but where is probably a better word um also I do go out primarily in my electric wheelchair and that has a seat belt on it so instead of tucking my tops into my pants I kind of cheat and wear my top out put my seat belt on and then just pull my shirt out a bit over my seat belt firstly because it looks good and secondly because it hides the seat belt <laughs> yeah um yeah I've really enjoyed doing this and I hope you can get something out of it. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.